piece in for the 2022 build um <laughs> truth be told this is probably been sitting around uh for about two weeks man uh but i do have stuff on the way uh for 2022 and i got uh let's see probably about two more products sitting around but y'all know uh we'll get to it eventually uh just your boy pretty much just been hauling up and down the highways and whatnot uh getting that grind in so we can get all of this stuff in man so Y'all know what it is. Got my little trusty dusty right here. Uh, gonna go ahead and just cut this box open. Uh, this right here is gonna be more of the same. Uh, I did do an unboxing on a different version of this amp. Heck, might have been earlier this year, to be honest with you, when I was uh, going PRV crazy. Uh, now, right now, we're going to panel crazy. Uh, so let's go ahead and get this box flipped up and open uh, so we can take a look at the product inside. All right, now shout out to PRV. Uh, they did wrap the hell out of this. And the reason why I decided to go with PRV for uh, this amp uh, is because of the power that I needed. And like I said, it'll be more of the same. Uh, so there she is, man, your 3500 or SQ 3500X. Uh, let me get her out the box and we'll take a more in-depth look at her here. Just a moment. All right, folks, so we went ahead and got the PRV SQ 3500X out of the box uh like i said man i went with prv basically i mean if y'all don't know prv uh they bought tim panel i guess the panel was like some italian company or whatever the history was on the company i guess they were into uh manufacturing their speakers and whatnot for uh oem like i guess for the cars over there or whatnot man so uh, i think the panel was about to go under and uh prv decided to go ahead and pick them up uh, supposedly they want to push them more for subwoofers and things like that, uh, due to the fact that PRV has a ton of speaker, uh, SKUs and whatnot. So they don't want to necessarily put Timpano in for a competitor. Uh, but nevertheless, uh, y'all know my build earlier this year was on, it was supposed to be all PRV. I couldn't find the sound that I wanted. Um, I don't know, man. Like I said, I'm a DS18 fanboy at the end of the day. Maybe I just got used to the way that the EXL uh, speaker sounded. Uh, but as y'all can see in the background, uh, we're going to go ahead and try some panel out uh, for 2022. And a couple videos ago, I did purchase the uh, Tempano TPT MB12 2K5 speakers. Uh, I got two of those. And that's the reason why we got this 3500X here. Um, this should be, yeah, should be the two ohm version. Uh, so basically what's going to happen, I got two of those um, TPT uh, MB12. I believe they're eight ohms a piece. Uh, so obviously I'm going to bridge them down because this is a mono amplifier. Uh, full range, obviously, class D 12 volt amp. Let, let's go ahead and pop the top. And the Nerva PRV not sending me something free. I mean, thank you all for the sticker. Uh, the PRV, this is vinyl. Uh, so this probably will go ahead and go out on the car. Um, but same type of deal. This one, thank you for purchasing a PRV audio amplifier. Um, like I said, man, I did do unboxing on this earlier this year. As a matter of fact, I was trying to think I was going to say last year, but it was earlier this year when I had the, um, SQ 3500X one ohm, one ohm version. Uh, but this, like I said, this time we got the two ohm, uh, let's do this here. rather keep her in the oh, damn this one feels better than the last one i'll tell you that all right now same thing as last time man uh for this to be a brazilian amplifier this thing is freaking humongous uh as heavy as 
a Korean board. Uh, but one thing for sure that I like about it, uh, one thing that I, I did discover the first time around that I bought one, um, sounds great, does have amazing sound quality to it. Uh, it does have fans in it. Hopefully y'all can see that on the camera here. Uh, but she does have fans in her. And like I said, man, the sound quality on this thing, it's, it's cute for a reason, because it does sound amazing. Big power, so you got the full size one uh, inputs on it. You got your 12 volt remote and ground. Let's spin her around. And you got your negative output and your positive output, man. So two in on that side, two in on that side. Um, it's not, like I said, you see the gain, uh, it's literally just up and down. So uh, you set that gain according to, um, you know, obviously you're supposed to set it according to the voltage of your deck. I haven't made a decision whether, um, whether I am or not gonna go ahead and get a DSP. I'm probably leaning toward getting one. Um, yeah, I know I did have the PRV, uh, I think 2.8X, I think that's the name of that DSP. I can't remember, maybe I'll link it in the video over here or whatever the hell. Uh, but I did have the, the DSP. Um, I know I said in the, the last time I unboxed this amp here, I was like, yo, yo, it's probably not an amp that you wanna get unless you're gonna have a DSP. Now, with that being said, um, with the amps, well, not the amps, but with the head units being that the way they are nowadays, where you can go and do fine tune settings and stuff like that, you might be able to go ahead and get away with this, especially on subwoofers. Uh, but you might be able to go ahead and get away with this um, without a DSP, man. But I don't know. Like I said, at the end of the day, I'm 50 50 on the DSP this time around. Um, Tim Pennell does not uh, have a uh, Tim Pennell branded DSP. Obviously, everything as a PRV. Uh, so I'll take a look at that, you know, later down the road. Uh, but this has been sitting around. Um, probably should have unboxed this a while ago. I think it's been a minute since I put a video up anyway. So just getting around to doing that. Uh, getting that good old PRV uh, SQ3500X out the box. Uh, like I said, man, this is a two ohm version. Uh, so essentially what it'll do is 2400 watts RMS at four ohms. Trying to find out, let's see. Okay, the two ohm 35. RMS power 13 volts is 2300 watts RMS. Y'all may or may not be able to see that. My camera doesn't do well with autofocus. But hopefully down there, right under that line, you can see 2300 watts RMS and that's at 13.0 volts at four ohms. Uh, so like I said, man, with me having the two 12s, uh, like I said, the TPT MB12 2.5K or 2500 watt speakers, um, we're gonna go ahead and get her going at four ohms, uh, get that full power, get those things slapping and screaming vocals down the street like we hope they can do. Um, most people that have had these speakers that have done reviews on them said they're amazing. So we'll go from there, man. So like I said, man, just doing a quick unboxing on the video or video, quick unboxing video uh, on the channel, man. Got the little sticker here and whatnot. So uh, probably go ahead and throw this up on the car. It is raining out there, so. We'll see what what's coming what's going coming down the pike. Maybe, or maybe not. The next video might be something big, <laughs> so stick around for that. Uh, eventually, I will get all these things unboxed and go from there. But let me go ahead and slide this out of the way. So, by the time I upload this video, it should be Monday, September twentieth. Y'all got till October first to get those uh, DS18 Pro TW320.8 Super Twitter with the bullet. Hopefully y'all can see them loud and clear back there, nice and clear. I'll try to pan over a little bit. Um, obviously, like I say, anything that's in green is going in the car. Those two jokers back there in the red are definitely up for the giveaway uh, right now. And I don't know, shout out to you guys or whoever's pushing the video, is it YouTube, the, al the algorithm or whatever's going on. That video has 4,500 views. I was only looking to get 500 by the first. Yeah, way more than that. Uh, I think it has like over 100 likes, but we still, just, the deal was 500 views, 500 likes, 500 comments by October 1st. Uh, so we still got some time, uh, just under two weeks now. 
Uh, but we still got some time, but you yeah, definitely want to get on that, man. Those two DS-18 Super Tweeters are going up, they're going out the door to your house. Uh, so, like I said, I've got a lot of DS-18 stuff. Not so much that I did have, but I still got, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six. I still got quite a bit of stuff, uh, quite a bit of merchandise from DS-18. Um, and like I've been saying, man, I'm trying to do giveaways uh, just to show appreciation. At the end of the day, yes, I do want the views on the channel. Um, obviously, things are changing. Uh, they're looking on the uh, upside, so staying positive around here, man. But make sure y'all get on that for the giveaway. Uh, like I said, they're brand spanking new. I never got around to using them, so since I'm switching to the panel, DS18 DS can come to your door, man. So y'all know the deal, man. Any questions, comments, concerns, go ahead and hit me up, man. I try to get back to everybody and... I just said September 20th, so we still a little under three months, but it is what it is. So 2021, and that's been the slogan. If your mirrors ain't shaking, damn it, you got taken. But all of that green stuff over there, and I can see part of my driver horn back there behind my amp. Tim panel, that's going to be for 2022. So we should probably say that again, because that's definitely the goal this time, especially with a 3,500 watt amp for two damn speakers. For 2022, if your mirrors ain't shaking, damn it, you got to take it, man. It's your boy, Young Dub. Y'all have a great day. I'm out of here. Stay positive, man. Like I said, uh, get on that giveaway so we can get those super tweeters out to your door, man. Uh, drop that number from one to 2,854. Um, I think we get a hashtag, ears bleeding. We will get two of those out to your door, man. If you win the competition, why not go ahead and get some free tweeters, man? Get some ears bleed, man. I'm out of here. Y'all stay good. Next video coming up soon. Could be something pretty big. Might be out of this shot, so we might have to change some things up, man. I'm out of here, man. Y'all have a good one. Hey, everybody. It's your boy, Young Dub here, man. Hope you all enjoyed the video. Just know that your thumbs are appreciated. Make sure you hit the like button and notification bell so you'll see the videos when they pop up. Also, make sure you subscribe to the channel for the best unboxing videos in car audio, man. Thank you all for watching the video. I'll see you on the next one.